Hey everybody, it is Ninja Mom here, and I am here with my very first Teddy Bees haul. I've never had her wax before. I've never even tried her wax before. So I am super duper excited. Some of this is mine, and some of it is a Christmas gift um, for my girl Angie. It's going to be going in her box, and her box is being shipped out tomorrow with all of her Christmas goodies in it. So let's dive in. We have two little scent cups right here. One is in County Fair. I don't have the scent descriptions for these and they're not on it. It smells, this smells like it has funnel cake in it. Definitely funnel cake is in there. Um, it smells kind of buttery and funnel cakey. I don't smell much of anything else except for like a buttery and a funnel cake, maybe a frosting. Yeah, that's all I smell in it. And that one is in County Fair. And then we have strawberry lavender pound cake. Mmm, that's a nice lavender she uses. It's kind of like an herbally sweet lavender. And it pairs really well with the pound cake that she uses. I like it because it's not like an artificially, it's not Bath and Body Works pound cake scent at all. It's a different type of strawberry pound cake. Um, and the lavender plays very, very well with it. That's really nice. Thank you. Those are really nice. Okay, so I got two loaves. I got one of her bars, clamshells, whatever she calls them. And then a souffle. So the wax bar, clamshell, whatever this may be. It's got eight bars in it. <laughs> so like her big clamshell um, is in milk and cookies and zucchini bread. Are milk and cookies blended with zucchini bread? Let's open it up. I like these clams. They're really big. And it's all pretty... Mmm. That smells really nice. I like her zucchini bread. It's not a it's not an icky zucchini bread. I like zucchini bread, but I'm kind of particular about it. This has nice light spices in it. And I don't know what her milk and cookies is. I've never had it, but this is a really, really nice, nice zucchini bread scent. Then we have lavender frosted circus cookies. Sweet lavender blended with our Frosted Circus sugar cookie. I'm a loaf girl, in case y'all haven't figured this out yet. Over all the time you guys have been watching me, I'm a loaf girl. Come on out. This smells impeccable, by the way. These smell so good. So this is the lavender Frosted Animal cookie, Circus cookies. Her lavender, you guys. Oh my gosh. And I don't really care for lavender, but this lavender is really, really, really good. This is a very, very, very yummy blend. Her, I have her Frosted Circus Sugar Cookie in a loaf. So I can tell you right now that that smells really, really good. And the way the lavender plays with this, this is amazing. I wish I'd have been fast enough to have been able to get a loaf of this. Very, very yummy. Now on to the loaves. We're gonna do the Frosted Circus Sugar Cookies, which is sweet sugar, buttery shortbread, buttercream frosting, vanilla sugar cookie dough. And it got like a little bit broke um, during shipping, but whatever. Oh, that smells really good. Mm. Come on out. Yeah, there's a little, you can see the little wax that gets caught in here, broke off and fell in there, but I don't really care. Look at the cute little sprinkles and designs. Oh, get back on there because you're getting me out, Ted. Oh, that's such a delicious, delicious blend. Oh my gosh, that smells so good. 
And then the final blend that we have is pistachio circus cookies, a blend of black pistachio dream cake, pistachio macaroon, and frosted sugar cookies. I have been on quite the pistachio kick lately, like big time on the pistachio kick. So I'm super thrilled. I didn't realize how many different versions of pistachio there are, but there is really a lot of different versions of it. So this one, you guys, actually does have that more um, pistachio dream cake. So it is that more um, cherried type pistachio. But with her circus cookies, oh my gosh, you guys. Freaking amazing. So I'm very pleased with my first haul. On cold, this stuff smells amazing. Um, I cannot wait to start warming some of these. Super yummy. Very excited. I did notice there's poor dates. On each and every one of them, there is poor dates. I do like that. So it tells me when she poured all of these. And I love that. There isn't a poor date. Oh, yes, there is. Right there. Poor date right there, too. Now, the little cups don't have them, but I don't care about that. Super awesome. Super duper awesome. And these are all cured, you guys. These are all ready to go. 10, 18, ready. 11, 10, ready as of today. Well, it depends on how long you let them. I let mine cure a month. 11, 14. So this one has a few more days. Pistachio has a few more days. And 11, 10. So this one's ready too. Awesome. So, everybody, if you've tried Teddy Bees, I would love to know what your thoughts are. Um, what your favorite blends are. If you've had any of these blends, what you think of them. And um, if you have not tried her, try her out. Um, I really like her stuff. It smells really, really good. I'm super excited um, to start melting some of these. I might actually crack into some of them tonight. So everybody, please like, share, subscribe, comment down below. Hit that notification bell to be notified every time that I upload. And I hope that you enjoyed these. Bye.